what I think is going to be like but basically my take of what I think is going to be the most played builds in uh 3.16 scourge that comes out in a couple of hours is this I think that people will play Toxic Rain Champion because it seems to me that the Toxic Rain Champion brings the most balanced approach to Toxic Rain in the entire uh, of all the Senesi classes. I think the Champion will outperform the other classes with Toxic Rain, which will be one of the most commonly league starting builds in the game. Then we have the Saboteur, uh, which uh, we're looking at miners and traps, right? So we're going to have Seismic Trap to some degree, but I think we're going to see a surge of Eye of Winter, but also Reap Miners. These builds can kill in-game bosses with almost nobody. They're squishy as fuck, but they're used to rush and kill bosses on the first couple of days of a league with no budgets needed. So they, that will be very, very played as well. We're going to see on the minion department, we're going to see a lot of people playing golems. We're going to see a handful of people playing specters. Uh, and, but I think that golems will be have a higher percent players than specters. Uh, I also think that we're going to see way more dark pack builds uh, than we have uh, before. And I think that we're still going to see a lot of uh, Freezing Pulse, Ice Spare, Totem builds. Now, if you look at the builds that I just mentioned, I have an Iowa Winter Miner build guide on my Vault page. And uh, this is the build that is designed by Path of Math. I made the written version for him. And we have a Dark Pack build guide that I will be playing. Uh, and I have the, uh, the Lich Queen, which I think is going to be a good starter. Uh, we have the guide for, uh, for Pure Spectres. And we have a guide for the Physical Golems. I don't have a guide for Toxic Rain. But I think that those are the most commonly uh, league starting builds that we're going to see in a couple of hours leading into uh, to Scourge 3.16. I don't see any of the other builds being able to perform as well as these builds will do. Obviously, we'll have the generic outliers. It's always going to be there, like ED Contagion and um, Vortex builds, people playing uh, the Cold Slinger version of that in the start. We're going to see a lot of people playing Dominating Blow, especially on the Soul Cell Fan department. People will be looking into Soul Dominating Blow as well. But I think that the TR champion seems to be really good. And then obviously we have the melee stuff. And I think there's going to be a lot about the steel skills. And then, of course, we're going to see people play the new abilities. But it's too early to tell if they're going to be good or not. But ED, Bane, Contagion, any combination of that will be a, a build that's going to be played a lot. But like I said, I think that the most played build is going to be Toxic Brain Champion, uh, uh, Physical Golem, starting with Karen Golem, and with more currency, you'll go Stone Golem later, because Stone Golems outperforms Karen Golems with a Harmony dual stacking, but Karen outperforms them before that. Uh, and we're definitely going to see Dark Pact, Golems, and Spectres. That's just the way to go. But I think we're going to see a fuckload of Savagers. We're going to see... Seismic Trap, we're going to see Eye of Winter, and we're going to see Reap as Mines or Traps, right? That's that's what I think is going to happen in uh, a couple of hours from now. That's it. That's what I think is going to happen.